Oh, I know. It's so scary. I love you. I love you. I love you. These guys have never had really human interaction. They're like, I don't know who you are. I don't know what's going on. I don't want to be part of this. They saw me and they hid. They hissed. They didn't really let me touch them. They're just petrified. Hi. Did you just hiss at me? Did we take a step back? The first day or so, I wasn't able to touch them, and I didn't push it. I didn't want to scare them more. I try to go at their pace as best that I can. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm sorry. Even as the days went on, Mac was just the spiciest little boy. As always, we have Mac. Evil glare for sure. Is everyone very mad at me? Yeah. Mom, you gave us dewormer. Gross. Nobody wants pets this morning because everybody's angry, so let's do breakfast time. Let's go morning. Hey, babies. Are we ready for breakfast? No hisses? Good job, Squid. Hey, Matt. I'd sit down with my coffee and I'd put the food near me and if they were brave enough they'd come and eat. But that way they really got used to me being in there and not being afraid of me if they were eating. Eventually one night I was telling them goodnight and Tuna licked me. I said, I think you're going to be the first to crack. And then every time I sat down she was on my lap. How are you doing, sweetie? Eventually the other fishies kind of followed suit. Hi, Mac. Yeah, I figured. I was really worried. Mac was really feral. He wouldn't let me get near him. He wouldn't let me touch him. Mac, I can see you. You're not fooling anybody. About a week and a half later, we had a person who was actually able to catch our fourth sibling, Miss Trout. When I put her in with the other fishies, Mac was just like, oh, my sister. It's like a piece of him was missing, and I brought her home. He wouldn't let her leave his sight. You guys are so cute. Mac O'More, is that your sister? You can tell they're related. They look so good. Once I brought Trout in, it was like he was a whole other kid. Um, hello? Can I help you? What? Oh my god. What is going on? Holy cow. Macaroni. I love you. The transformation, it's so rewarding. Knowing that these guys won't ever have to have a cold night out on the streets ever again. It's everything. I've learned so much from them. They've showed me that as long as you are taking steps forward, even if you're taking steps back, eventually you're going to get there. It's going to be okay. Whoever gets them are just going to be so incredibly lucky.